What's up everybody, welcome back to another video on my channel. My name is Dion and you're watching Reptiliatus. Friends, today I'm going to be sharing with you the first of several vlog episodes depicting the adventures my friends and I went on in Florida. Everything from shark diving, canoeing with alligators, herping for wild invasive veiled chameleons, and animal con. I will say that <laughs> I really did not film enough of Animal Con. It's kind of awkward in hindsight. I think I was just really present and doing my thing there, going from panel to panel, but I really do regret how little I filmed. So I do have a few clips that hopefully give some indication of how much of a good time I had. It was wonderful seeing all my friends, some of which I hadn't met in person yet. So that was really special. I want to take a moment to sincerely thank Brian and Lori Barczyk and everyone on their team for putting together such an incredible community build event because honestly that is one of the things I cherish the most about attending Animal Con it was the immense sense of unity and community that you saw between all the creators coming together having such a good time focusing on education and spreading the message that we all have in unison in, in uh, that, that similarity is that we love the animals and we want to share our passion and it was just a beautiful thing to be a part of. Call me a cheese ball, but I really loved it for that. It was lovely to meet many of you there. Thank you so much for attending and saying hi. And I'll stop talking and we'll get right into the first episode. I will post the next one probably sooner than in a normal upload schedule. And I hope you'll love the rest too. So with that being said, thank you so much for watching friends. Enjoy and see you soon. All right guys, it's night one. Yep. A good friend Nick here has already started herping and he found a nice little Mediterranean house gecko. Alright guys, we've officially arrived. We're gonna be shark diving. I'm gonna be honest, I'm kind of, how do I put it, a bit nervous. As much as I'm very excited about this experience to interact with these animals that are a very integral part of the ecosystem. Uh, you know, there's some unpredictability. Alright guys, so we are here with Matt of Shark Safari. You want to tell us a little bit about yourself, what you're doing here, uh, what got you started? Uh... Yeah, so basically we um, get people out to, to see sharks in, uh, in the natural environment, kind of give it all the myths and stuff you see on Shark Week, kind of change their minds about what sharks really are and how they really act and behave. Take people three miles offshore in Jupiter, no certifications needed, you just hop right in, grab a mask and snorkel, we'll teach you everything you need to know. It's pretty misunderstood animals, so it's nice to show people the other side of sharks that you don't get to see in movies and on the news. So how this is going to go guys, Will already cut the bait up. So we got our fresh-ish sushi here for our uh, fin friends. Eye contact, very important with these animals. Make sure you're standing your ground. Make sure you're looking these animals directly in our eyes, especially our bull sharks and sandbar sharks. I do want you guys defending your personal space. By that, I mean six inches in front of you. Your one opportunity to touch a shark. If they come in your personal space, hand on top of the head, close to the dorsal, on top of the head, not under the head. That's where the teeth are and just kind of lock your elbow out and guide it away. Sharks have to swim at all times. So they can only swim in one direction. Really splashing with the fish and the big shark. <laughs> They're slapping for sharks. Mike, how you feeling, buddy? Excited. Yeah? Nick, how you doing there, buddy? Pretty bumped. <laughs> okay, guys, excuse my penguin voice. We are going overboard to swim with some sharks. So, uh, see how that goes. I'm extremely excited, slightly nervous, but it's going to be amazing. All right. It 
It's so hard to put into words how magical it felt drifting calmly with these animals. Dare I say, this felt like some sort of spiritual experience. And yes, when you choose to go into the water with sharks, you have to be respectful of their space, of their home. But they are the farthest thing from the monstrous animals sensationalized by television shows. They're curious, elegant, and graceful beings that serve an irreplaceable role in an ocean ecosystem. swims into it. Oh, shit. <laughs> Right, guys we just made it back to shore i just want to say a huge thank you to shark safari and jupiter matt will jake this was an amazing experience i'm gonna stop talking because will has to grab something <laughs> sorry <laughs> but no honestly we're just yeah we're just getting back to shore here but this was truly uh, i think i don't want to steal the words here from steve but like you, you'd call it a lifetime or once in a lifetime experience but you don't want it to be the only time <laughs> i'm stealing his words but it was well put seriously couldn't have asked for a better turnout they all came out to say hi <laughs> it was so cool and i couldn't recommend it more so there'll be links down in the description if you want to get more information thank you thank you thank you jake thank you for filming that experience it was amazing thank you again for will making this happen just want to take a moment to say thanks so much to jake for being our videographer of course, this experience man. the work you do is amazing it's crazy watching you go down there with the sharks i've been diving with sharks for eight years I've just been always obsessed since I was a kid. Super cool. No, man, thanks so much again. Course, really dude. appreciate it. So, guys, where are we going? Waffle House. Waffle House? A brunch. Hello. <laughs> Hi, mate. Welcome to. Wakiva Springs. State Park. Wow. We're gonna go swimming and kayaking with alligators. Is that the plan? Hopefully. <laughs> yeah, it's beautiful. Water bottle? <laughs> I love it. I hope I put my phone in here. Gentlemen, hello. Your balance is 
Super easy. There's a smile from Steve finally. Instead of serial killer face at the restaurant. <laughs> Okay guys, so Nick over there just found a soft shell turtle. Oh yeah, it's over there. There's his nose. It's a small one. I'm used to seeing huge soft shells here. We're here <laughs> in the American Everglades. The crocodile. There's alligators everywhere. Over there. There's alligators absolutely everywhere. Everywhere you turn, everywhere you look. Now, if you take a look up ahead, Nick's there. Is he gonna make it? Find out soon. I'll probably pass the meeting. What? Yeah, that's just not. They didn't see it because they don't be like tucked back there. Just sleeping, yeah. So you gotta really look. Yep. Hell yeah. Oh uh, yeah, just the head. <laughs> Crikey, mate. Poor dogs. That's like two people. That's three. Thirty-two inches. Not going much closer because he's gonna bolt. I'm trying. He's about to. He's about to. Okay. Yeah. He already. So Natasha, how's it going? Good, how are you? Oh, pretty good. Just uh, enjoying my uh, orange slush that Brayden recommended. It's very delicious. But uh, you're having something different here, aren't you? Yes, I am. Here. I'm having a lemonade creamsicle. Wow, yeah, yeah a lot of ice cream on there. Yeah, and it's amazing. Between. Very good, delicious. Mm -hmm. Wild Sand Hill Cranes. Got a real gator on a fake gator. Brayden's getting his uh, Philly cheesesteak, is that correct? Yep. And Tash has this like epic chicken steak. Oh, he does? Enjoy. And I got my ribeye steak. I do not know how I will financially recover from this. For all of you guys who keep creeping figs in your vivariums, the really cool thing about it is as soon as it has nowhere else to actually grip onto, it starts developing into this really normal looking fig type growth, which is its adult form. And from that, you can actually get edible fruit from it that I'm here. here. Are you vlogging? Okay, so we're trying this again. Here we go, here we go. Yeah, that's like the 